Russian Rascals. Uh. Welcome back, World of Tankers. My name is Jet, and welcome back to Russian Rascals here in World of Tank Splits. We're going to be looking at the Ox. Uh, things you need to know about the Ox, it's basically a Type 58, just a reskin with retractable horns, and it shoots fire at its backside um, when it fires a shell. Pretty cool cosmetics, although it is really not necessary. But anyways, on to the tank. It's a pretty average tank with an average DPM. Um, so middle class DPM with 1800 damage per minute with your AP, 1500 with your APCR, and 2700 with your HE. Now that is that performance is affected by your penetration. So penetration on your AP is going to be looking at 128 millimeters. Um, on your APCR is going to be looking at 172 millimeters and your HE is going to be looking at 43 millimeters. Now these all have pretty good alphas so you can mix up your DPMs. You have uh, 200 alpha with your AP, 170 alpha with your APCR, and 300 alpha with your HE. So you want to be hitting people on the side, you want to be hitting people in the butt like light tanks to basically get the most damage out of it as you can with your HE so that um, you can be doing more than just spotting. Anyways, let's talk about the mobility and the traversing. So your aim time is going to be looking at 2.13 seconds. Not the best first class, but it's okay. Uh, dispersion is going to be 0.335 still average for its class but it's going to be okay turret traverse speed of 58.3 degrees per second so you're going to be it will make a full rotation in about six seconds so moving on good mobility at 55 kilometers per hour forward 20 kilometers per hour backwards all in all it's a really snippy tank uh you mostly want to be using this thing's mobility to be doing circles around the enemy team and not getting shot by like these kv2s kv1s's and the now dead su 100 y uh let's talk about armor really quick armor is pretty bad with only 45 to 55 millimeters of effective armor around the hole the turret is your only source of hope for bouncing any shots with 100 millimeters of effective armor around the gun 300 millimeters of effective armor on the cheeks when you're looking at the tank from the front not from the sides from the front from the side you only have about 85 ish millimeters of effective armor and around 50 millimeters in the back of the tur turret with a very weak cupola all in all you don't want to be trading shots you want to be moving around and that is the battle one good job death by rubber ducky for doing a master class 3 with 1400 damage and two tanks destroyed very good uh awesome job oh no is this a good tank yeah it's pretty okay uh for the experienced player who wants a challenge we definitely recommend this tank and it's very worth it for those who are experienced enough to make this a good tank to get it with the battle pass or if you want to just blow the money and get the battle pass anyways and get the tank anyways you go right on ahead anyways guys thank you so much for watching uh join our discord in the description thank you death by rubber ducky uh he sent in his replay through our to our email which is also in the description if you want to send your replays of epic moments that you have had in any tank we take master class threes all the way to uh masteries and just funny moments with like kv2s derping light tanks anyways guys thank you so much for watching and we will see you in the next video Peace.